I'm Ed Massey with Massey Yacht Seals. Today we're going to talk about our Catalina Seal Florida Free Purchase Program. Uh, it's a pretty simple program, very straightforward. The way it works is you order a yacht or purchase a new Catalina from Massey. And, uh, and if you want to enjoy the Florida winters, maybe you have family in Florida, uh, we will keep the boat here for six months uh, with the following uh, free uh, advantages. There will be free dockage, free cosmetic maintenance, uh, free fuel when you use your boat, free guardianage service, a free concierge service, uh, four-day owner orientation when you take possession of your boat, uh, custom outfitting as, as you wish, and uh, free yacht prep for shipping at the end of the six months, this is a six month program, when your yacht is ready to ship back to your home base. Uh, the program is particularly useful uh, for folks that like the Florida winters but don't have a, a Catalina in their home area. Um, if you have a Catalina dealer in your home area, they may be able to, to uh, replicate this program to, to one degree or another. But if, um, if you don't have a, a local Catalina dealer, Come see us and we will put this program together for you and I think you'll enjoy it. We've had a couple from Columbus, Ohio, Carly and Mike Morosky, that purchased uh, the Catalina 425 this year, uh, six months ago. And they've been using the boat uh, intermittently during the last six months. And we're gonna hear from them now and find out how this experience worked for them. So with that, I'm going to turn this over to Mike and Carly. So I'm going to ask um, Mike and Carly a few questions, and they're going to give us their candid uh, responses. Um, first question, why was the Sail Florida Free Purchase Program ideal for your plans? Um, well, I'll, I'll take a crack at this first. Um, <clears throat> you know, bigger picture is we were looking for a boat, and it would have been um, more or less our first sailboat. So we were looking for someone who could sell the boat to us, and explain the technical aspect of, you know, what we need to find in a boat, what's important for someone at our skill level. Um, and what my wife really wanted to know was she wanted to feel good about it and comfortable about it. And so I want to pay you a compliment, Ed, because we could not have found a better person to buy the boat from. We instantly felt comfortable with you and that we could trust you and that, um, Frankly, what you were telling us was more about how to do this than about selling us a boat, you know? And I, we appreciate that. So I wanted to thank you for, for that up front. Um, the Florida Sail Program was an amazing experience for us because it was really uh, the best of all worlds. We got six free months down here in a part of the country that let's face it, everyone wants to be in, um, especially during the winter time. And being from Ohio, it's brutally cold. And so we plan, we bought the boat in um, October and we planned on coming down once a month for the next six months, which we more or less did. We did. Mm -hmm. And um, built our sailing skills, used that as an opportunity to get better every time we came down here. And, um, you know, we created a bunch of different stories, some of which we've shared with you running into this, and some great memories, not only with each other, but with our three kids. And um, it's just been a wonderful experience for us. So we appreciate it and thank you. How important was the four day owner orientation? Very important. Uh, working with Jeff and Jean, um, that was amazing, um, especially for me. Um, not really having a lot of uh, docking, um, sailing skills, um, and it it really helped out coming down here for the, we did it in two weekends, and um, we, I mean, we worked on docking like one full day, just several hours of just docking, and, um, you know, he, he had, you know, the experience, but for me and for the two of us to be on the boat, I needed to, to have that um, experience and, and feel good about being able to take the boat out with him. So it was very important. Yeah, and I'll add to that just a little bit. We love Jeff and Jean. They're perfect. I don't know how you quite 
figured out that for a husband and wife, having someone like Jeff and Jean is a perfect compliment because Jeff and I immediately bonded over, you know, all the finer points of sailing, how the mechanicals work, you know, the do's and the don'ts while you're piloting the boat. And Jean helped Carly with everything else that she finds interesting, maintaining everything in the galley, um, you know, meals to cook, you know, how to um, work the docking lines. And it was great, and you know we still stay in touch with them. Actually, yeah, we just text them two days ago. Yeah. We told them about our docking mishap in uh, Venice at <laughs> the crow's <laughs> nest, and you know they send back a funny little reply. But it, you know, we kind of bonded with them, and, and it was a wonderful experience. Uh, part of our orientation is we had uh, Jim Friend from Friendship Marine come to the boat and go uh, through the Marine Marine nav instruments. And I wanted to know how useful that was and did it make you feel a lot more confident about how the newer Ray Marine instruments work? Yes, it did. Um, <clears throat> I did not have any previous experience with um, the instruments or Ray Marine. So I was overwhelmed, frankly, and a little bit intimidated um, by the prospect of having to use them and rely on them. And so he came in and spent uh, an hour and a half, two hours going through it. And it was a whirlwind. I, I took notes while I was there and I don't think I absorbed but maybe 20 or 30% of it. But it was enough so that when I was out on the water with Carly, I could use it. And I said to her the other day, um, now that we're done with our six months of, of training here more or less, I actually feel good with the instruments and had them configured to my liking. and. We were able to use autopilot a lot, a lot, which is very helpful. And, you know, the man overboard function, fortunately, we haven't had to use it, but she and I both know how to use it in the event mm -hmm. that that comes up. Um, so, yeah, Jim was excellent. Uh, one of the important features of uh, the CO4 free program is the uh, guardianage and the concierge uh, portion or service. Uh, what condition was your boat in each time that you arrived? Excellent. I mean, it was just, it was wonderful. We'd let you know when we were coming in town, and the, you'd have the boat cooled down, and the refrigerators, you know, all in, uh, chilled and, and cooled and everything, and um, it, was, it was just perfect. Everything was great. Yeah, I can't tell you how many times she would... She said April's name. Oh, I love April. She, <laughs> she can read my mind on, you know, how to get the boat prep. Uh, for, just so everybody knows, April Swisher is uh, our detailer, and she's been with us 15 years now and is, is dedicated uh, to the boat owners as anybody could possibly be and really takes her career. She's turned detailing into career. So she's highly valued here at uh, Massey Yacht Sales. Another question, um, how did you like having your yacht here at Regatta Point Marina? I thought, I mean, we've been to a number of marinas and boy, are we gonna miss this one. Um, the marina is, is wonderful. Um, the facilities are great. Um, the, res the, the two different restaurants that are right here um, our youngest daughter did go to get ice cream a couple mm. of times. That's right there. Um, I mean, we loved it here. So Captain Jeff of Jeff and Jean, when they were training us, they said, you um, are so lucky to be in Bradenton. And I don't think I appreciated that at the time. Um, and I asked him why, of course, and he said, because it's right next to Tampa Bay, which you can always sail in in almost any condition but it's centrally located on you know, the southwest coast of Florida, so you can go north up to Treasure Island. Um, yeah, or you can go to St. Petersburg, which we loved, or you can go south, and you've just got everything right uh, there. It's, you've got the proximate location. Anchorage. On the the anchorages side. and so forth. Mm -hmm. So um, this is such a great marina because of that um, location alone, let alone even with all the amenities on top of that. How did you find sailing on Florida's west coast in general? That <laughs> was a good yeah. lead-in. Um, amazing, we were talking about that just yesterday, about 
all the neat things you could do from sailing offshore, um, which we, we went about 10 miles offshore a few times, which was exciting. We saw dolphin and turtles. She's got a great turtle yeah. story. Mm -hmm. And um, of course, we went into Tampa Bay and then we explored the intercoastal. And there was just so much to do. It was amazing. Um, I think my favorite would have to be going down to Cabbage Key. I um, wish we would have had more time to go further south. We just, you know, kind of ran out of time. Yeah. Uh, did you enjoy the Florida winter this year? <laughs> of course. I was a little chilly during Christmas time when we had the, you know, the kids all on the boat and everything. But, you know, I mean, we're from Ohio, so we're used to that. Yep. Was Massey attentive to your needs? Of course, yes. You, I mean, we just text you and then you always had an answer and you, know. you did a great job Ed. we appreciate everything you did and would never hesitate to buy another boat from you although we want to keep this one forever we're so happy <laughs> <laughs> would you suggest uh, sail florida free to other out of area catalina buyers i think it's a no-brainer especially you know over the winter i mean for us it just was a no-brainer being able to um, you know, uh, there's so many different airports to come in and out of um, where you can kind of, you know, especially if you're flying southwest, you can kind of check to see, you know, who has the lowest fares, you know, and it just, it really was just a breeze. It was fun. What did you not like about the Sail Florida Free program? That it's ending. It's <laughs> six months. The termination is, is here, so that would probably be... Yeah. Well, I want to tell you that it's been a pleasure for Massey Yacht Sales to have met you, uh, been involved with your yachting plans, and um, and likewise, we're we're saddened to see you go. Uh, we'd kind of like for you to stay, <laughs> um, but that's not how the program works. And so the next the next step for us is we will take your yacht this coming week and we will take it to Sneed Island Boat Works right here in the Manatee River and we'll prep her for shipping north. I know you've already uh, contracted with Joel uh, Yacht Transport and uh, and uh, right about uh, by May 1st you'll have your boat on Lake Erie there in Sandusky, Ohio enjoying the beautiful weather up there and in a real nice sailing environment in that that area. Um, for those of you that are interested to learn more about the Massey Sail Florida Free uh, Yacht Purchase Program, feel free to contact me directly, Ed Massey, at 941-725-2350 or at edwardm at masseyyacht.com. I have information I can send you. I can answer all your questions. We can talk about Catalina delivery and uh, availability. Um, and I want you to remember this. Catalinas are uniquely American, with a strong focus on performance, safety at sea, and enduring value. They are overbuilt and underpriced, and that's why Catalina yachts are the sailor's choice. <laughs>